Tutorial 103 in drawing for Katia. Now it is time for an important step in your drawing, which is the dimensioning. In this tutorial, we are going to cover the linear dimensioning. And before you start using the linear dimensioning, you remember the theoretical principle for dimensioning in the school. You learn in the school the principle of engineering drawing so for dimensioning or professional dimensioning there is some rules you need to follow to make your dimensioning and there is another way to use random dimensioning and is not recommended so if you are familiar with the principle of dimensioning you can start with the linear dimensioning so let's go to the linear dimensioning from insert dimensioning dimensions and here you have the different type of dimensioning so in this section you have the linear dimensions also you can find the dimensioning toolbox on the right side you have this icon and if you don't see your toolbox either to be hidden down here or if it is not there you can find it by right click and find the dimensions uh, toolbox or in the previous tutorial we learned how to restore to default your toolboxes so click on the linear dimensioning here and you will see this toolbox here you see the type of dimensioning from the small icon so for example let's start make dimensioning this side again click on linear dimensioning here you're going let's click escape again and make sure that you are selecting the right side for example here you have the vertical so click this side now you are able to, to make another dimensions and again select this side make another dimensioning here also you can if you have a different styles of drawing you can choose which dimensioning type you want 